Happy Wednesday, everyone. This is a pick a card reading for Wednesday, December 16th. You pick a card for your main energy, but I do pull it all together. It is a reading for all of us. And December 16th, birthdays, we will do you next. Okay, if you pick card number one for December 16th, Wednesday, you have the Eight of Cups. Okay, so the Eight of Cups, what are we seeing here? Um, well, you know, messages may be important today. I feel maybe you'll get a text message, a call. Um, maybe you're just, you'll see something on social media is a possibility. Um, maybe it's going to disappoint you and just don't let anything, um, bring any negative thoughts into your head. You know, it's time to move on. Um, these are lessons that are learned, um, and it's time to just walk away from anything that no longer serves you. And it's like, you know, it is a way of walking away. Um, and that is going to bring you more luck, new people, new situations into your life. So there is some good news coming through too. For some of you, this could be if you are in, um, on a dating app or um, something like that. There could be a lot of love offers coming in, but you may be kind of um, not... You're not intriguing it, okay? And I think some of you may be reminiscing a lot of the past, but it's okay. It's time to move on, though. So anything that doesn't serve you, it's like emotionally just walking away from it and moving forward. If you got card number... If you pick card number two for December 16th, Wednesday, you have the Queen of Swords. Okay, so the Queen of Swords. To me, this is... Your words have power today, is what I'm feeling. Okay? Um, there is something that you're going to have to think heavily over. Um, this is, to me, a path. For some of you, a path situation is possible. And it's almost like a return of energy. And it's time to finally put an ending to something. So it's like you're kind of putting your foot down. Um, you're not taking crap from anyone anymore or a situation. I do see that energy. It's like you're really, um, kind of standing up for yourself. Okay. You're kind of taking your power back is what I'm feeling here. You could be dealing with a Capricorn for some reason. I'm picking up that energy. It could be very business focused today too. It's like you are really, um, on the ball too. Um, I do see that also don't make any quick assumptions without getting all the facts. But there is something about your intuition and also past behavior or behavior that you can actually combine together and make a sound decision here. Um, you have a very strong new power and new beginning today. And a lot of things that you do want and that you're desiring, it's right there. It's within reach. you got the power to do so. If you pick card number two, uh, three, for today, December 16th, Wednesday, you have the Six of Cups. And the Six of Cups, to me, what I'm seeing here is reminiscing the past, okay? For some of you, this is maybe um, someone from the past comes and visits because, or you're going to, or your thoughts of travel to go see someone, okay? There is some good energy here, too. I feel that you may be talking to people or connecting to people that you haven't talked to in a while, too. I do see that. There's a lot of good energy here, there, though, I have to say. I feel like um, maybe you hear a song, uh, music, or something that's going to remind you about the past, too. I feel a Leo energy that's present, too, for some of you. Um, just be aware of who is, you know, pay attention who's in your inner circle, too. Um, because there's something that may be, be a trigger or something familiar to the past that's going to um, put a piece of puzzle together for some of you, okay? That's what I'm feeling there. All right, so when we pull this together, we have the Eight of Cups, we have the Queen of Swords, and we have the Six of Cups. Very interesting day, right? Um, there is a focus on the things that we desire and that we want today too. So we do have to leave something behind or wrap up the past somehow to be able to move forward. Some of us may be dealing, I don't know why I'm picking up either investments, time, energy, um, learning something or it's property matters is very possible too. Um, there is a little bit of disappointments. Okay. Um, I feel it's maybe someone you realize took advantage of you. Um, it's like, be careful of not letting anyone use you somehow too. So just 
that energy does show up. I also feel here um, it's a little bit of chaotic energy. All right. So it's like your kind of mind is back and forth today. But we are at very strong new beginnings. Okay. So something may be revealed, maybe a secret or some kind of information. And that sets off a new beginning. We are at new beginnings here. Okay. Very interesting. Well, that is the reading for today, Wednesday, December 16th. I hope you have a great day. Okay, moving on to December 16th, babies. Happy birthday if you're born today or if you know someone born today. This is a quick reading for your solar year. This is your wish card. I do a similar reading like this and many other readings on my website. People ask me that all the time. Okay, so your solar year theme, Four of Pentacles. Four of Pentacles is a year where, um, you know, you have to broaden your horizons in one way. I see that. Okay, this is making practical, sound financial decisions, investing, savings. A lot of you will be holding on to, um, you know, it's a practicality. It's something building for the future. It's There is a focus here, but there is a stubborn streak to this too. So needing to open up your horizons is very important. Money could be an important aspect this year as well. Um, I do see happiness. I still see bright new beginnings, especially if you do conserve your energy or your mind or time or money as well. Um, for some of you, maybe dealing with some kind of property matters this year. For some of you, it's like for a long time, you've been not too happy with uh, maybe a salary or um, some investment, but I see big money. For some of you, you may actually go from rags to riches, Okay. That is a possibility from what I'm feeling here. Um, I do see also for work, career, or um, schooling, whatever you do, powerful new beginning. There's endings and new beginnings there. Um, there is um, a victory. So um, this is starting a um, great job. This is starting, um, you know, there's a sense of some victory Um coming through there, so I do like that energy or a very new in um um new job or something where it's like it's going to your intellect is going to be noticed as I want to say when it comes to finances, I feel um where you're going to have to kind of um clear your financial um standing somehow, whether it's debt, are you feeling restricted because of debt? Um, where you feel there's a sense of needing to break free somehow. Um, don't um, overspend, don't buy anything um, expensive without thinking through because it could be buyer's remorse. So there is a sense of break, needing to break free a little bit with finances. For some of you will, like I said, they could be a big win for some. When it comes to relationships, if you are single, I do feel that this is a year where you will be I want to say you're going through a process. You're going to have to put your um, borders up somehow. It's like fighting back. Maybe maybe you get a lot of suitors, but you're going to be fighting back because um, pushing back because um, maybe they're just not the right ones for you. So things are taking a little bit of a process. Um, there's a little bit of a competitive energy too. If you are in a relationship, there is a sense of... Um, competitive energy. Maybe someone has eyes on your partner and you kind of have to fight them back. So I do feel that energy. Um, you as with your partner that may be also uh, reevaluating who is in your inner circle as friends and um, putting borders up too as well. When it comes to all relationships, this is a, a year where you're going to stop any kind of um, interference, uh, bullies that are around um, people who have wasted your time. So there's a sense of um, kind of recalibration and um, pushing off anyone, pushing away anyone and putting up orders that do not work for you anymore. Okay. So yeah, that energy did come through. All right. For your wish for your solar year, you have the page of pentacles. To me, what I feel here is it's a yes. But it's going to take a few steps, okay, um, and um, removing some kind of obstacles. I feel for some of you, this is going to be um, a journey ahead, moving away or something with a location. But there is some help here too, okay? So I do see that energy. It's basically a yes. I like that. All right. The important numbers for your solar year is 1, 10, 
10, 8, 6, 7, and 4. I want to wish you a very happy birthday today and a wonderful solar year ahead and everyone else a wonderful Wednesday and bye for now.